Bruce by Mandy here outside Coco's on deck six near the atrium. Coco's has chocolates, crepes, treats, coffees, different things. Um, several years ago, one of the big things that really attracted us with Norwegian was their midnight chocolate buffet. Such extravagant chocolate artwork. And really, you aren't supposed to touch that. Um, pretty much everything in this display right here is edible. Coco's is not open yet for the day, but just to show what it has right here, they have the huge sundaes and different treats. These are not included in your cruise fare or ultimate dining package. So what you would do is charge them to your room key. And you always have a room key that you can use. I keep mine on a lanyard. Once again, always sing healthy here. And you are right outside the atrium to do that. Coco's is located next to the teppanyaki. So if you didn't like the uh, green tree ice, green tea ice cream or other desserts they offer at teppanyaki, run next door, use your room key and you can grab a good chocolate dessert. And this kind of reminds me of the chocolate fountain at Bellagio, but not completely. But how often do you see chocolate being poured on a cruise ship? Cruise by Mandy signing off from Coco's on board Norwegian Bliss.